Okay. <laughs> so, this is probably the realest YouTube video you're ever gonna see, um, at least in the past from my channel. I mean, I've done a lot of exercise stuff before, but I've never recorded like a little vlog where I've been dripping sweat and uh, recovering from working hard. Here and there, I do some stuff in the garden, um, but I'm typically not speaking, so I apologize ahead of time if I'm a little out of breath, but before it gets dark here, uh, we just started having rain in Vasconia, Parita yesterday. I don't know what today's date is. We're in the mid to end of the month. I think it's around the 18th or 20th of March, 2024. So we've actually been experiencing rain a little early. It's been super hot throughout the days in Parita and the beaches, Palo Seco, Playa Bandera. It is super hot right now and dry and people are struggling. But thankfully here in Vasconia, um, we've gotten rain. Yesterday afternoon we had it for a couple hours, then it stopped for dinner time. And then later at night it started raining again. So it was beautiful sleeping last night. And a benefit of that, oh, and let me just say, side note, the reason I am shirtless and actually in a towel right now is because I just did a couple hours of uh, cleaning up all the grass that the lawn cutter guys um, left, and we're going to be using that to build in the next couple of years with Terrabellum Collective, uh, making Cobb and Adobe-style cabins here for rent. So in the future, you'll be able to go on Airbnb and search the Jungle Temple and be able to rent these things that we're going to build by hand with materials that we've sourced, natural materials from the Jungle Temple property. So I'm accumulating all of that grass into piles part of the day and then the next part of the day or the next morning I will be going and gathering it up with a wheelbarrow and then bringing it to a bodega like a storage area uh, and then it continues to dry in there until we need to use it. But I was wandering my little stream here on the property, the little river that runs through the property just to see how everything looks and, and where I need to work in the future and, and what fruits are uh, around right now because we have manzana de agua or a water apple um, and they're fantastic and delicious i'm actually going to go get some after this video but when i was in the river this is the fun part about living where i live and, and in costa rica in general but specifically where i live i'm super lucky i live downstream from a massive and i'm talking massive like 10,000 trees plus papaya farm which is private but because I'm the next door neighbor, and when it rains, this is what happens. So in my river, I get free, high quality papaya. And these are like the good ones. These are not like the round ones that people can play. These are the, the long ones. Um, uh oh, I lost you. I banged these giant papayas down on the table. Here we are. And uh, yeah, so. This is a smaller one, but it's still, this is what they sell in the store. So once this ripens, it turns yellow and delicious. So you can see this one's already starting to turn a little bit. So in another day or two, these guys will all be ripe. And I love to eat papaya. My dogs love to eat papayas. Friends that come over love to eat these. And I have a friend coming over tomorrow. Uh, you guys can actually look her up on YouTube. It's Helen B. Yoga. And... Uh, I think she's from Romania originally, but she lives down near Uvita now. And we connected on social media, actually, because we're kind of small time YouTubers here and with a similar philosophy. And um, yeah, so this is awesome. This is like a gift from God for me, free food, but also to share with my guests and my dogs. They love papayas too. So really fun little finding today. That's what the nature of this video is about. Um, so if you're looking to buy property in Costa Rica, be very alert of who your neighbors are. If you are a neighbor of a fruit farm and there happens to be a river nearby and you're on the downflow of that river, the outflow I should say, you might wind up reaping free foods for the rest of your life that they're growing high quality to sell in markets. And these actually go to San Jose and they're exported across the world. So the best quality papayas in the world for free a benefit of living in Costa Rica and uh, yeah that's what the video is today about so free papaya from my neighbors thank you Papillo if you wind up seeing this or Danny his son um, thank you guys I appreciate it I will give you guys infinite manzana de agua if you want to trade <laughs> anytime but 
Yeah, one of the benefits of visiting the Jungle Temple here in Perita, Costa Rica is we get all types of fresh fruit, not just because of the stuff that I'm growing, but the things that are just around in the environment and they find their way onto the property. It's amazing, it's a miracle. It is paradise and the Garden of Eden all in one. Thank you guys for tuning in. Until next time, I love you.